Welcome to TYT Sports, Francis Maxwell here with a special show. We're actually going to pay homage to you, our great fans, by uh, bringing up some of the best comments we've seen uh, on our YouTube channel. Um, some of them positive, negative, but we take them all on the chin here. Uh, it's just great to hear back from you guys, and uh, some of them are absolutely hilarious. So uh, let's throw up our first comment from Andy Ronan. 14-01, jerk of the game, the sky, me, fell asleep during halftime, I used to see all four Saturday games, but this one was just too much. Buddy, I, I don't, there's no way, I can't uh, like say that's wrong for you to do that. There, I mean, watching every game does get tiring, and when you do get those boring nil-nil games, uh, I totally relate to you on that. I mean, I think Jason had to wake me up uh, during one of the games out there watching it because uh, it, but, uh, you think watching soccer all the time get, doesn't get boring but some of the games like you just want to either get out there and assist them by doing something to make the game somewhat alive or you just want to go for a nap. So uh, I feel for you on that one. Next comment. Jason uh, Magana. Honduras was jerk of the game. They were literally jerks because they played so dirty. So this is what I think about Honduras. They remind me a lot of like Stoke in the English Premier League. They know that they, their quality doesn't match up to the likes of uh, the teams that are playing like France in that game. But they have to try and find a, a way to win it. So they went out and make sure to leave the boot in when they were tackling, especially even when they were going two or three nil down, they were still smashing into tackles. And um, I agree with you on that, that they maybe were a bit over the top with their aggressiveness, but you got to do what you got to do to win, so I can't uh, completely disregard their, their methods. Uh, it works for Stoke on occasion, so I'm um, sorry for Stoke fans out there, you aren't that bad. Uh, let's move on to the next comment. Pound underscore cake one. Can you do an all-female panel on the best looking players at the World Cup for TYT Sports? We were actually talking about this. This would be a great thing to do, I think. Uh, I would even pilot uh, chime in on this. I'm, like, uh, I'm comfortable with my sexuality. I don't mind saying what guys out there are good looking. I mean, we all know about my man crush on Pirlo. Great beard, amazing hair. Should win the, for the best looking guy at the competition, but there is the likes of Ronaldo and them who come in there. Jason also has a lot of fans that he likes in, the, in this tournament. Balotelli, be your man. Absolutely, Balotelli. Okay, from, is that, would I say Jamie? Is that Jaime's or Jamie's? All right, thanks. Franz Kiss, or maybe you'd prefer Frank Kiss. <laughs> pronouncing someone's name is correctly, uh, pronouncing someone's name correctly is so silly, right? Uh, you're a disrespectful ass. Okay, so <laughs> for those that haven't uh, watched TYC Sports as much and noticed, I am from Scotland. I do not cover every single language. I mean, my pronunciation of Spanish names and Argentinian, Bosnian, obviously it's not going to be perfect. I'm not multicultural that I know everyone's pronunciation. In America, people just decide to make up nicknames for my name. I get called Frankie or Franco or Fran or Franny Max, as it's been coming here, which is, I mean, you just take it with a pinch of salt. I'm not out here trying to butcher your name. I'm trying to find a way that, to try and pronounce it. I, I, I pronounce it, sorry. It's just the way it works. If I'm not from that country, it kind of is hard to, to adapt to the different uh, pronunciations or spellings of it. So please cut me a little slack. I appreciate it, and I apologize to anyone I offended, but call me whatever you want. I'll take it on the chin. All right, next comment. Packers, three, two, four, five. L1 triangle all day. Everyone that plays FIFA laugh when he said that because it's effing deadly. I'm trying to watch my language from my mum watching. So, um, L1 triangle is, is, I don't hate to keep referring to Jason, Jason, but he's my only friend in TYT. Everyone else doesn't really like me. So, Jason, we actually play FIFA and I must use L1 triangle every three minutes. It's the best move, especially when you've got a player who can like play passes like that. Cavani in that game of Uruguay, it was a beautiful pass, L1 triangle all day. So I'll keep using FIFA references as long as you guys keep responding to them. Uh, yeah, and next. also uh, to, oh, address, to address the um, uh, FIFA fans for TYT Esports, which came from a comment also, that name we're probably gonna use because it's great. Uh, we we're, we got a capture card and we're gonna get a much more ironed out uh, segment for it and we look forward to playing you guys uh, in the future. So again, send us your gamer tags to TYT Sports. We're gonna get a nice list going and we're gonna mm -hmm. continuously uh, be reaching out to you guys to play, especially when the round of 16 in the World Cup starts. Please send in your gamer tags. I need a challenge. Playing Jason is like playing a guy with no hands or playing someone that's just had a 90 pound dumbbell dropped on their hands. It's pretty awful. So we need new players out there.